Hi friends, welcome back to my channel. I am so happy you guys are here today. I am in one of my favorite cities for thrifting, Dallas, Texas. If you guys are a member from my 48 hours of thrifting video in Dallas, I just hit the jackpot on all of their thrift stores. They were incredible. So today I am back at it in Dallas. I am not alone today, guys. I have one of my favorite people ever. I'm staring at her because I'm so excited to introduce her. It's Erica. Hi. This is my friend Erica. She has an incredible vintage shop here. She has like the best I, she's just such a bright and happy person. <laughs> we met for the first time at the Flea Style in Market in October, and I feel like we just hit it off. Like yes. we were like very like kindred spirits, and it was like we had been friends for so long. And we've been talking ever since. Yes, <laughs> tell them a yep. little bit about your shop and what you do and where they can find you and all that good stuff. Yes, so I have a vintage store on Etsy, and it's called Erica Nicole Vintage, and I have an assortment of vintage women's apparel, and I make scrunchie tops, and I. I use like vintage Harley Davidson. I think you showed one. Yes, I did. Yeah. Um, I bought one of her tees. I'll like insert it here because <laughs> they are incredible. She's so crafty. I feel like the Harley scrunchie tee girl now. Yeah, like, so she's branching out now. She's gonna do like some other things besides Harley. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yay! I'm so excited. Yeah. All of her shop info is below so you can shop her and her Instagram, everything. She yeah. also just has like killer style. Like oh your style God. is so good. So, so you. <laughs> thanks. So she is going to take us to all of her like honey holes here yes. in Dallas. We are going to the best of the best. And I'm so excited to have Erica here. So we are standing outside of a vintage shop here in Dallas called Dolly. The called Dolly. Python. Dolly vintage. Python. Dolly Python. goodie. Yes. They have a lot of like homeware stuff, but a lot of vintage clothes. So yeah. we're gonna go into the store and just take you guys around and we're gonna just do like a little thrift store tour oh, yeah. of Dallas. It's gonna be incredible and Erica is gonna be my guide along the way. Yes. I'm so excited. We can't wait to show you what we find. So let's go. <laughs> like a few days before New Year's Eve so I'm like full on sequins right now and I just found this incredible probably 80s oh right? Oh my god. Little puff sleeves. sleeve. This gets me. Like I'm usually not into like the stuff like this. Yeah. It's a little too like cheesy. What about the like, other one you found that was so good? <gasps> this one that's like yes. artwork? Yeah. Look at this. So good. Is this not like a Matisse painting or something? Like, <laughs> sure we'll say yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's incredible. Oh, it's insane. So good, but yep. I'm definitely gonna try this one on. It's only 24. Oh, so yeah, this could be like the perfect New Year's Eve top. Mm -hmm. Look what Erica found. Have you ever? No, it's a jumpsuit and it has like the sailor collar halter top. Oh my gosh, extra zoom for the buttons. Yeah, it's so good. And it's like linen, it's so cute. I love that it's not like that bad 70s polyester. Right. This dress is incredible, but it is so tiny. It's like this checkered print netting, and then it has all of these beading down the front. Beautiful. We both found our perfect dresses. No, this is, these are both very us. <laughs> yeah, they really are. So this is like a drop waist fifties dress with all this ruching and like I don't even know, but I need somewhere to wear this. It's incredible. And then yours is this it's a sixties. Um, what print is this? I don't even know. Hypnotic, like trippy print. Yeah. <laughs> and then with these boots. So cute. I love the little ruffle bottom and the little collar. Oh yeah. Dude, it's no, so thick you? too. That's so cute. So you. <laughs> <laughs>
this not like so Carrie Bradshaw? This 80s polka dot dress, it's so good. Did you just break the hanger? Erica? <laughs> That's, <gasps> with all the pom poms. That's like an 80s dream. No one saw it. <laughs> Basically my dream dress. Ostrich feathers, a little bit of like tinsel. Oh, so good. This is like the ball gown section. Look at this one. Yeah. I know, I love the shape of that oh, one. She's fuzzy. <gasps> she's fuzzy. Ooh, she feels like a rug. Oh yeah. That's so cute. Ooh, I've been looking for a pair of these like high-waisted 80s leather pants and I just found the perfect pair. Look at these belt loops. It's gonna be the perfect like paperback waist. We're about to try on everything. Three things. I feel like your stuff is very you and my stuff is very me. It's like sequins, plaid, leather. <laughs> so good. <laughs> Here's this jacket I found. It just looks too roby. Like I feel like a old man. Make it as morning. Yeah. <laughs> the moment I wake up. <laughs> I think this is gonna be a no, but I wish it would have worked. The pattern is so good. Here's that little sequined puff sleeve top. The sleeves are so good. The perfect New Year's Eve top. Even though I already have one, but maybe I should do an outfit change. You know, you have to. <laughs> I think it's expected. That is so cute. The I feel like it's weird. so you. I feel like it's the perfect statement. Yes. And all of like the closures, like it's like yes. sturdy. That's like heavy duty. Okay, and with my uh, Peaceology pants that have the like leather and denim patch. Ooh, yes. I love that. These are both nose like friends. <laughs> this one's just like, okay, wait, where does my waist end? And then Erica has on like a child yeah. shirt. <laughs> <laughs> Let's hope this I don't it. was good in theory, but just not didn't play out well for me. But it's a little carry too. It's very carry, but it very just carry. very carry. But it needs to be like not so drop waist. Yeah. Right? Dropped it low. <laughs> Dropped it too low. <laughs> Erica's like trying to like get hers oh to close. God. Meanwhile, I'm like compensating for all of her small things with these giant ass pants. But I'm like actually crying. <laughs> I'm so sad. These are out now. We're still trying to find the 80s leather pants, yep. sadly. All right, we are heading out, and what did you get? This incredible sweater, or not sweater, it's a vest. <laughs> that you're gonna wear over a sweater. Yes, that's it's what we're so talking about, yeah. Good. I didn't end up getting anything just because I feel like I don't want to get something just to get something, you know? You're having you willpower. Yes, so. you have to get something because you really love it. So, fingers crossed, next Because you're stop. not gonna wear it if you don't. <laughs> yeah, this place was incredible though. I'm so glad that we went to a vintage store because I haven't been to a vintage shop here, and this one was so good. There was so like it was just packed. Yeah, they have a variety. It was like yeah. you couldn't get through. They <laughs> we were working out on the rack. Sweaty. Yeah. <laughs> so we're gonna check out and then we're gonna go head to a Goodwill. Fingers crossed for more so good fun. <laughs> Where are we now? The we are at Goodwill Westmoreland, and it's actually connected to their Dallas offices, so it's pretty big. So are we gonna find some good stuff, do yeah. you think? I found an Oscar de la Renta hot pink velvet and satin dress last year, so <gasps> I'm right. find something good Channel again. my yeah. energy, yes. let's channel it. Thrift Gods on three. One, One two, two, three, Thrift Gods! <laughs> No shoes? No. No shoe luck. Ooh. This is a set, and I only knew this because it has two hangers. So then I was like, there has to be a bottom. Look on the ground, bam. You have to do that. So it has a vest, and it's very 90s tag. City and triangles. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and then it has like the pants and the top. So 90s, but that's so cute. Imagine wearing this with like a turtleneck underneath. That's what I was thinking. Yes, we're on the same page. Yeah. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to see that on you. 
a lot's happening right now. So, so much. So many things. <laughs> I was gonna show you guys this. We'll start here. Yes. Um, Erica has the best eye, and I told her I wanted a long um, plaid skirt, and she just found this one. It's vintage. Yes. And it's Check Union the tags made. if you don't believe us. Union made. So mm -hmm. this is made by the uh, women's union, and it's like the perfect. Pattern in length too. Boots, yes, yeah. I found this dress, which is like kind of crazy. I wouldn't, <laughs> but look at this giant bow on the back. What I would do, I have this black dress, and I want to like sew this giant bow on like the back here. Yeah, like a open back. Like imagine. This I can see bow. it. <laughs> like an 80s vibe so we'll see it's 12 35 which i feel like is a little bit pricey if I'm uh, just to do the bow yeah we don't know but we'll see i yeah. really i've been searching for i just told yeah you did that i want to find a pink bow like this so yeah maybe, maybe it's worth it yeah Listen up, guys. I found the coolest jumpsuit ever. It's this like textured black material, and then it has this huge lapel collar. And then, oh, it doesn't have the buttons. You or can put buttons it? on. Patron buttons. It'll be cute. DIY that shit. <laughs> you heard it here first. Check out this incredible handmade dress. It has sunflowers and like patchwork plaid all over it so cute look at the little pockets we finished up in the dresses we're in the middle of the sweaters but we're gonna give you a little sneak peek of a few of our favorite pieces we found because we have found some freaking yeah. gyms our cart is full it's like already <laughs> so full and we've only gone through like a fourth of the store taylor found me this top and i was <gasps> telling her that i wanted a white top that had like puff sleeves and like the high collar, so thank you. You're welcome. And then <laughs> I found this plain sweater, but I don't have one in this color and I thought it was nice. So. I love it, and the tag is so good. We're oh, yeah. such a sucker for vintage I tags. Know. We've been like geeking out all day. Yeah. <laughs> First, I've been searching for the perfect sweater vest, so I'm hoping this is the one. It's from Liz Claiborne, and she's my girl. Like, oh, yeah. He, Liz Claiborne always has the best stuff. You put so. it in the cart if you find it. I know. And then I found this, like, incredible mint condition. It's a Wilson's leather, like, Kelly Green little mini skirt. Mm, it looks so it good, with, like, yeah. like, a sweater and some, like, combat boots. Oh, yeah. We did, like, a little dance when we found these. Like, you found, I found this, and then you yeah. found Yeah, you didn't else. even say anything. We just, like, we both, both just, Made eye contact, we're just like, oh. <laughs> Everyone here hates us, by the way. Our cart is so full. She's looking good. She's, looking <laughs> she, she's She's chonky. <laughs> now, how do we get in here? Is it locked? Yeah. I think you gotta do the crawl. So, I have on these pants. They're a little crazy, but I'd wear this with a cream sweater and I think it would like tone down the prints, but they're super high. -waisted. Super high. I this love like. <laughs> that booty's banging, girl. Yes. What did you find, Erica? So, I found this. Uh, what is this like Dalmatian? No, <laughs> it's like okay. white leopard. And this part's velvet, and it's wait, that's oh. velvet. Yeah. <gasps> wait, I know. Oh game my gosh. Changers. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Look how hot our butt. Here is the green leather skirt. Fits like a glove. Ten dollars in basically perfect condition. So I think I'm gonna have to get that. I think I found my sweater vest, guys. I would definitely pair, you know, some sort of like, maybe like turtleneck under it um, and wear it with jeans, maybe kind of like slouch it a little bit. And then my pants are these really amazing, like kind of army green linen trousers. And I love that the lining inside is this like contrast orange. So when I rolled them up, they look even better. I would probably wear this with some sort of cropped shirt that's tight on the top 
because they're kind of baggier, but these are really, really good. I can go home now. I've yes. <laughs> so Taylor found this for me. I was telling her that I wanted a white, like, um, pilgrim girl top, and I found it. Yep. Check that off the list. Yep. Yes. So I have on two things. First, this is like a super vintage Pepsi Cola, like thermal, and then the skirt Erica found me. I could totally see this like more of a grunge look maybe with like my leather trench over this and some like combat boots I think this could be so good so going home with me today is this white top that has all the ruffles on it that Taylor found for me and then this is a donation from Taylor she didn't want it so I took it and we think this is from the 60s or 70s so it's really cool it's like the original mm-hmm and then I just got a plain sweater because I don't have any in this color, so I felt justified for getting it. This is a random pickup for my boyfriend because he has an Etsy store too. This crazy jumpsuit with the velvet collar with the polka dots or like animal print. So good. That was and like the find of the day. These pants. I only got three things, um, but first is this like, it's like a glove, green Wilson's leather skirt. I think this will just be really good in the winter with just tights and like a sweater. Finally, the sweater vest that I've been looking for for so long. I love this one. It kind of is like very reminiscent of like 70s with this like mixed um, pattern here. So really excited about that one. And then last is the little plaid pleated skirt that Erica found her. Round of applause. It's so, so good. good. It's like everything I was looking for. So I'm really happy with everything I found and I think we're gonna go ahead to another Goodwill now. Yay! Yay! <laughs> destination they close at seven right so we have oh, like, what time is it? like half an hour yeah <laughs> so we did a quick perusal of the shoes, shoes and, bags. and bags yeah. and we found like we hit the jackpot Instant. <laughs> we're always here for a beaded bag moment and we found this little one and this one's wooden but it's so cute and it's so a mini handbag and then this tote and it has acrylic beaded uh beads on it and then the wood I love the contrast. And then we actually found two pairs of really good boots. First, these 80s, like little cowboy boots. They're not in the greatest condition. They would definitely need to be resold, but they're incredible. And then these, which are totally like so Gucci or Chanel. They have the square toe and the little buckle. And then the angled heel. Sadly, they're both too big for me, which is like such a bummer, but these are incredible. Go, go, Tay, go, Tay, go, Tay. <laughs> oh, I feel like this oh, is yes, really cute. Yes, like, I love that. Little, like, it's like perfectly cropped. It yeah. This, um, pink sweater. And it's the softest, prettiest, I babiest know. pink. Mm -hmm. I'm having a moment with the pink sweaters. Look at this little Liz Playboy. We found sweater. so much Liz this today. This is like really vintage Liz, yeah. though. Oh, it's what so is that, like 80s, 70s, 80s? It is a day of sweaters. Check out this cute little, like, enlarged argyle print yes don't put your hands in the thrift store pockets know, rule number one <laughs> that's so cute on you yeah, i, I love pockets. it yeah the little square pockets on the bottom right throw in the cart girl erica <laughs> found me this she walked right past it too what's her problem i we are on a time crunch i know the store will be closing in seven minutes all customers need to come. Listen, I'm tired of getting yelled at at Goodwills. <laughs> or has closed. Mm -hmm. We're gonna have to do our haul in the car. We're gonna check out and then head out. It's been six so, hours. I know, it doesn't seem like well, it. I know, it does yeah. not seem like it. It feels like we've been thrifting for like a few hours. I but know. time flies when you're having fun. I know. <laughs> All right, guys, we got kicked out of the Goodwill. Yeah. We were like hiding in the back of the store, yeah. still <laughs> shopping after the store closed like 10 no, minutes. No, we were like after. on our knees on the ground. <laughs> yeah. We were taking the thumbnail photo on the ground so that they couldn't see. <laughs> yeah. It was really good though. I wish we had, had more time to I look know. through them because they had some really good stuff. So we're gonna give you guys a quick haul. Sorry for the light. It's car lighting. I know, my forehead is not this big. 
let's do this little haul yes. before we sign out. Time to say, say bye. Say bye. Well, into the haul. So first, I got that really cool little beaded belt. It would belt. <laughs> I wish that would be cute. Yeah, beaded bag. The patchwork coat, which is just so crazy good. I feel yeah. like I could start a shop. You really just could. have a patchwork stuff. And then the last thing I picked up was that little Liz Claiborne, like really like millennial pink little sweater and it just has all these really cool kind of stitching all into it like different patterns and stuff i just love the like fuzziness of it and the um the shoulder pads i think that's gonna yeah. be really cute it's like dainty and will be really cute just with like jeans and stuff right. my camera finally called it quits after six hours of filming i'm so. about to follow your camera's lead <laughs> <laughs> so last part of this we're filming on the phone yeah. so what did you get erica okay i got these Burberry-esque plaid pants. They have black, white, tan, and red, and they're high-waisted, and I think they'll be super cute they're with just like so a graphic good. tee or a sweater. Yeah. And then Taylor found me these black high-waisted uh, slack pants, because I told her I was looking for them, because I just want to just stuff everything, like tuck everything mm -hmm. into these. Yeah. And then I just got this, I think I got this because you were trying on plaid jackets. Oh. Can you tell? It's just a plaid Here, jacket, and it has a color block collar and then the pockets are the same as the collar. Well, it has been a long six hours of thrifting, but just goes by so fast I and know. you're thrifting with your friend. Oh, I think my favorite store was, well, Dolly Python was really incredible. That's an experience. Yeah. yeah, that is an experience. Obviously it's not a thrift store, so I feel like it's not comparable to the Goodwills we went to, but I think maybe this last store was yeah. one of my favorites. Even though we didn't get to like go through it a bunch, I just felt like there was a lot of really good vintage in there. What was your Fave. I would say maybe this one because yeah. that was so quick and we found a yeah. good amount of stuff. So I always feel like it's like those quick trips where you just like you like zoom in on right. exactly what you're looking for. Again, you can find Erica on Instagram yes. and her vintage store, Erica Nicole Vintage, and um, I will again tag all of her stuff below. Please go follow her. She has incredible style, and you can see how she styles up some of her thrifted finds and also give her shop a look yes. because her um, one-of-a-kind t-shirts and sweatshirts and all of those goodies and vintage stuff is just, she has such a great curated selection of things. And one thing, oh, yes. if you're local, you can now purchase in person at Flea Style in their Frisco and their Deep Elm store, so. If you're local, you should yes. come by and look and at And you my guys stuff. just saw me go to Flea Style yeah. in my last video. So you can now go to those shops and find her there yeah, um, if you're local excited. to Dallas. Yeah. Um, but obviously, you can shop her on Etsy. All the time. Um, all the time. Yeah. So if you like this video, please like, comment, subscribe, ring that bell if you already subscribe and you like these i make videos every thursday all about thrift fashion sustainability so i hope you guys have enjoyed today's video we had yeah. such a fun time together it's gonna be a recurring thing every time i come back to dallas we're gonna do it oh yeah so i think that's it friends thanks for tuning in bye, bye. kobe <laughs> <laughs>